fellow Sudokans, and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Friday the 4th of November 2022. It's still morning here. Um, it's a bit noisy outside. There seems to be a car revving that has been revving for ages and ages, but I, I have to get on and play this game. Uh, I've got to do some work later. Actually, I have to do some work now, but the instructions have been unclear, and so I'm waiting for a message to clarify the instructions and so in the meantime and since I'm going to be out and all afternoon uh, I should try to get on with the New York Times hard level game right I can see these nines blocking across here very nicely with a nine up there so why don't I stick a nine right there uh, we also have a two blocking across this row and a two down here so let's start Let's put a two in here, I should say. Ah, oh, is that car driving away? Come on, go away, go away. You're really annoying me. Uh, right, we have five blocking across here, so that puts five into one of these two squares. Five blocking across and across and a five down here. That's going to give us a five there. Right, we have a six blocking down here, so that puts six into one of these two squares. So now the six and two give us our blocking pattern down here. So that means that these two squares must contain only six or two. So knowing that that's six or two, uh, it means that we know eight blocks across here. And so eight is in one of these squares, so cannot possibly appear in either of these squares. So eight must go there that car hasn't gone it's just revving up in annoying me causing me to lose concentration never mind eights across like this it goes here we need a special sudoku silent zone don't we i wish i had a little studio that i you know that was soundproofed and then i could avoid all of these sound issues that i have uh, you know one that had silent air conditioning or something as well that would be nice uh, taint never gonna happen though. Uh, right, back here. So now we know the five blocks across here. So the five has to be in that square. And now we can finish off with our six. As I said before, six and two are in those squares. So we know that the 8 is here. That's going to put 8 up there. What else do we know? Uh, this is 6 and 2. So 5 blocking down here. So the 5 must go in that square there. And we've got 5 blocking across like this and down and down. So 5 in that square there. All right, missing numbers here are one and something, one and three, I believe. So the three blocks across here, so that's where the three goes. The one is here now. And we know this is six and two, right? So this is, these three squares contain one, three, eight. So we've got the three and the eight in the same row, so that's where the one must appear. Um, now we've got 3 and 8 here, and so in these squares up here we have 4 and 7. Uh, okay, and so here is uh, 5, 8, 9, isn't it? Is that right? 5, 8, 9. We got the 5 and the 8. Okay, so just to try and get it straight in my head. Right, now we have twos blocking up, well, up there as well, but up here like this and across here. So that's the location for two. And we have two across here and across here. So that's our two. 
two blocking up here, two across here and across here. That's our two. No, we can't finish it off. That's a shame. We're going to be left with those squares. Um, what's missing from here? Well, we've got threes in these squares. So, well, we don't because we've got three blocking across like that. So that's our three. So left now we will have six and seven. So if that's six and seven, that also must be six or seven. Sorry if this car is annoying you. It's really annoying me. I've got no idea what it's doing out there. I think it's gone. Yeehaw. Right. Okay, good. Right. Now, maybe I can concentrate a bit more. So we have our one blocking up here and one across here. That puts one into one of these two squares. Let's block down. One blocking down here, one across here. And there's our one. Uh, I see a 9 blocking across here with a 9 down here, so 9 in one of these two squares blocking back in this direction and a 9 blocking down here, so that's where the 9 resides. Uh, missing digits in these three are three, six, and eight. I see the six and the eight with attacking this square here, so that's got to be our three. So now we can say the threes across here and the three down here. That's our three. And if you remember, this was three and eight, wasn't it? So eight goes there. Then we have eights across here, across here, and down here. So eight in that square. One empty square here. Better fill that in before somebody shouts at the screen. That will be a six. Six then blocking up here and across here and across here puts a six there. Ah, I'm getting the re no, I'm not getting the reply. I'm getting new work coming in. Ah, yeah, I was expecting more work, um, but I wasn't expecting it yet. Nobody expects the Spanish work at this time of the day. Right, missing digit here is... Um, da, 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 I lost my focus. See, I hate when e emails interrupt me. I lose my concentration. What am I looking for? I'm looking for a number that fits here. It's going to be a 6, isn't it? Right, we have three blocking this square, but we need a three in this row, so that's where the three goes. One finishes off that row. Okay, we have seven blocking down here, so that's where the seven goes. One empty square, I think it's a nine that fits there. We have nine blocking this square, so that's the location of nine. Two finishes off that block there, two blocks across here. Here's the 
2 and this will be a 6 I remember from previously 6 across 6 down 6 goes in that square the missing number here is a 4 um, Can't finish it. Uh, right, what else? Nine, seven. Uh, one empty square I've just noticed up here, so I'd better fill that in with a uh, four. Ah, uh, that's good. Four across here and four up here. So that's the position of four. Seven is that finishes that column, I remember. Seven blocking across here. So here's our seven. The last number here is a one. Three blocking this square. Three blocking this square. So that's the location of three. nine blocks this square so that's where the nine goes five finishes this row five blocks across here like this so that's the five the missing number here is an eight i think people might be complaining today's game has been very easy hasn't it uh well below the normal standard unless there's something here there could be something lurking in these last few digits i suppose but i'm guessing not and if that's the case, then really um, quite um, below standard for the New York Times hard level game, which is really often, uh, especially yesterday, was a real headache, actually. Uh, really needed a lot of tricky gameplay, I think, yesterday. I think, I think that's right. Could be wrong. Nine across like that. That's going to be our nine, then. So we have one blocking up here and one across here, here's our one the last number to get here is a four last number to get here is I've forgotten uh, seven okay I did work that out before and then I forgot again right so now what do we need, we need the one blocking down here, no there's no room for a logic puzzle at this stage, definitely not so that means the game has been extremely easy for a New York Times hard level game. Eight blocking eight down here. That's an eight four finishes today's game. Wow. Okay. Super uh, easy then. That's it. And uh, I might be back after many hours um, and might be exhausted when I play the game later tonight. But anyway, let's see. Bye bye.